I'm ready, baby. What's up, buddies? Welcome back to another episode of The Ultimate RTG, where we combine the insane grind and dedication of the poor man road to glory with the rich man funding, with the first owner obsession, with the fresh card obsession, and everything else in between. I can't wait to just get grinding with this series. We are busy investing right now, but I think... One of the main focal points of the title of the epi and of the thumbnail of the epi is for the first time ever, I have hit an obnoxiously crazy player. Whereas in the last 12 years, it takes me months to hit a crazy pack pull like we did yesterday night. So we packed Neymar unbelievably late night grinding on stream. We managed to hit Neymar. Now, I didn't spoil it because we also packed another obnoxious player. The player I packed outside of Neymar is a better day one player than I've ever packed in the history of FIFA Ultimate Team. And then we packed Neymar. So you can imagine how decent the player is um, on top of the Neymar pack pool. So obviously, I'm going to put it in the title, dudes. It's one of the best things that's happened to me at the start of FIFA. Uh, hopefully, you guys can understand that. If you're here for this road to glory, um, there are going to be lots of surprises. As mentioned, the second pack pool is going to be a big surprise. Um, obviously, the grinding. Uh, we've got, you know, all of the 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 the, the player reviews, the, the past and present squad builders. There's going to be plenty of surprises down the road, but... To get into some search titles to make a little bit of that uh, almighty dollar, we got to throw that into the title. So hopefully it doesn't bother you guys too much. So before we get into anything else, I want to go over all of that stuff that's happened. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump over here and I don't know, like, would it be better to do it like this and then just get rid of my d dumb face? W would that be better? Cool. I don't know. I, I feel like... There it is. So first one, Finally first pull. Semi decent boys. I what is he like twenty k? Let's go though, man. Oh, that's gonna be the first highlight for episode three, I suppose. It is. It is Nick twenty eighteen. Just a little bit of chipping away on the web app, boys. Things you absolutely love to see. We got our very own first owner, Ansu Fati, who I am going to keep. I'm not gonna sell this guy. I'm very very excited about getting him. Um, and just as an update to you guys as well, we are up to 145,000 coins right now. Okay, and, so the coin balance uh, doesn't we'll really go. matter all that much, if I'm going to be completely honest. But that was the first highlight to show you guys. Um, first one is there. Highlight number two is... Uh, I don't even know, We're actually. PlayStation, right? I think oh, Xbox God. Has... Oh, Ooh, wait, was it Hamas? Hamas? Wait, was Hamas highlight number two? There's no way. Wait, was James Rodriguez my highlight number two? Bro, was it that dead up until this point? I can't remember, bro. I mean, dude, we've done so much grinding on this account so far. Okay, perfect. It's the next pack. Yo, I'm excited, man. What? I don't even know who this is. Oh, never mind. I do. Wait, 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 wait. Where's my reaction? Oh, God, I'm so fat. Wait, did I even care? Hold on. Wait, what? On uh Madden. Oh my <laughs> god! Finally! Alright. Finally, boys! A little bit. Let's go! <sighs> oh my god! Until we can afford Root Hullet, we have our box to box mid, baby. Okay, dude, wow. relax. KDB. I hate to even look at this man's price, dude. Oh, he's half a million. Oh, no, he's not. He's 300K. Damn, 300K for KDB seems cheap. That was yesterday, that though. I think it's like 430 now. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Absolutely well, fantastic. the second highlight of the day. Okay. Oh, Who's this idiot talking? Title? Oh, my God. I packed KDB. That is the question. No, that's not going to be the title. <laughs> YouTube like to see? Would they like it spoiled or would they not like it spoiled? YouTube basically doesn't Armalika like anything us about this uh, one, in terms sure. of title spoilers. I've discovered. No worries. We'll let Armalika use this one. Uh, use him for the uh, the share play games. Oh, little did Nick 2018 know. Let's go, boys. Hold on. Little so, did he YouTube, know. Gonna... All right. So I believe highlight three is going to be the poll. I think. Feeling... Okay. Oh! Wait. Oh my God. Wait, did I pack Jesus and then Neymar? And 
Wait, so in 10 packs, I hit De Bruyne, Jesus, and then Neymar? Is that real? Hold on a second. And he's extinct. I don't know if he's still extinct today or not. Oh my lord, guys. That is actually kind of crazy. <laughs> Why is Nick flirting with past Nick? I just, you know, sometimes I piss myself off, you know? Four star, what is he this year? Four star, three star is kind of trash. I think I'd still go Richarlison, personally. Um, but if I needed a link, I can get a strong link to either Allen or De Bruyne in the squad. Fantastic. So I, I gotta I say, dudes, in two games, uh, Richarlison and Jesus, for anybody that's looking at that type of an upgrade, I know they're both relatively expensive, so it's a lot of money, but I like Richarlison way more than Jesus, man. Jesus, to be fair, to the team was today. being subbed on. Um, wait, was it actually the next pack? Oh, wait, no, so that is high. Oh, wait, is this, are the games highlight number five? Oh, okay. So highlight number four for those of you that care. Um, I actually, again, I can't remember about this, but anyways, so we got Jesus and I think this is right. Oh, <laughs> okay. I remind you. I'm fine. I'm fine. This is fine. Everything's fine. I remind I'm that this fine. is, this is a guy that's oh! in his mid thirties. For pixels on a screen. Now, do I'm I fine. wish I'm fine? This, this was fine. on console. Of course. I'm fine. I did it on the web app, dude. Oh my god. De Bruyne and Neymar in the same run. What the fuck? Nah. Nah. On the web app. Oh my god. <laughs> All right. Is this guy done? <laughs> How much am I going to milk this? Okay. How All much? All right, then. Are you done? Okay, fine. No, oh, he's still milking That's it. whatever, dude. <laughs> still milking what? it, bro. Oh, my God. I milked this for bro? four minutes? I can't watch this. It's been built for Neymar I can't. I can't watch it. Look I can't watch that. it. I can't watch it. I can't, I, can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm sorry. I can't do it. Oh! I can't do it. Oh, God. I can't. Okay, that's it. Bye. I'm See fine. you. <laughs> uh, real quick, though, I did want to show you guys this as well because I thought it was pretty important. Um, here it is. Okay, so this I thought would be uh, fun. I think I'm going to show you guys all the goals here, too. So this is our second qualification game here. So this, yeah, and, well, uh, I'll just let this moron explain get it. ourselves another insane win. Now, to be fair, obviously, my team's crazy, right? So, um... No issue. Either way, I, I, if I lose games, it's going to be my fault. If I win games, the team's really going to help me get some Ws. That is for damn sure. Um, it was crazy, though. Neymar with two goals and two assists. Uh, as you can see, bottom, Richarlison with three goals. It was crazy back and forth. Now, obviously, I won the game, so it was definitely more enjoyable. That guy's a flat founder. Wow. Okay. Fair enough. Respect there. Uh, so in terms of the goals, this was the first one to kick us off. Nice little scoop turn into space. I don't know. Kind of a crazy angle to score from, but never. Richarlison mind. is nuts, uh, by the way, boys. Second one. So Nene. good. Richarlison. Five-star five -star weak star foot. Right. Bang. We're going to miss that. Third. Lovely run into space by Bale. And a little dink uh, over to Richarlison to finish on his weak foot again. Uh, I don't know how this wasn't a red card. Oh, no, I, I do. His right back was uh, was back. Okay, makes sense. Nene with number four. Um, I thought he was offside, but simple tap in there. Almost scuffed it, dear God. Uh, KDB getting a goal. Neymar, I, I, I was... What a, what a play. What a play, by the way. That's probably the only good goal I scored. Um, Neymar feels better than he did last year. And that's yeah. saying something because that's Neymar a fact. was one of my favorite players last year. In terms that's of, a like, fact. Intricate dribbles and skill. I mean, you shouldn't be surprised, yes. right? Oh, KDV, dear lord. Um, then he scored this, which is a bit concerning. A lot of people are saying that uh, headers are broken. Ironically, his only chance was that. So, look, I am not against. This guy could have scored another two chances. I could have probably scored another five goals. I like that sh this is back and forth and crazy like this. I really hope our community. Lovely little chip from Nene. Um,. I really hope our community doesn't sit there and start screaming at EA because it's way too hard to defend. 
look, I dominated this guy, and I'll be the first one to admit that I had no idea what I was doing defensively. Uh, he could have easily scored all four of those chances he had because yeah. I had no clue what was going on. Yeah. Also, I agree. he didn't really have much clue what was going on defensively. I was tearing him to shreds. I would rather see this as a scoreline than me barely beating this guy one nothing. With him still sitting back, I agree. And getting pummeled, anyways. I agree. I like this. I like. I, I like. I like late night Nick twenty eighteen. He's a smart boy. So I, I will just build on uh, that thought process with you guys. I really am enjoying the fact that nobody has a goddamn clue what's going on right now. Um, I, I, I like that. Oh damn! Hold on. I, I can't believe I have to do this. Why does it? Why is my Elgato doing this all the time? Um. I'm going to have to like reset it, dude. So this is going to glitch out. Hopefully it, it doesn't complete ruin the entire recording here. Um, but I enjoy the fact that right now it's pandemonium in FIFA where nobody really has a damn clue what's going on. And why do I like that? Well, I like it because we're all in the same boat, right? So, you know, just, just a bit of trading boys, a bit of casual trading, picked him up for what? 20 K, uh, 32 sale. Um, I like it. I, I do enjoy the fact that we're we're all lost. Uh, defending is very hard. I just hope that be, because this stuff is so difficult, I really do hope that the community is going to sit here and scream and cry at EA so that EA do patch the, the hell out of this game to bring um, AI defending back. I, I, I want to struggle against someone defensively if they are the one being the defender if i'm creating 10 15 20 chances against an opponent so he's up to 277k huh um i can't believe i missed out on this van dyke van dyke's now like almost 600k uh if i can't score against someone i want to look back and be like my god that guy was just a crazy good defender instead of what we had last year where it was like infuriating because your opponents didn't have to do anything and the game just did everything for them right it, it was so counterintuitive to what you would want from a a sporting footballing game for a skill gap where you don't have to do anything like very silly so i hope the gameplay stays very fluid this feels like very old fifa is like almost an arcadey style of fifa look last year we got kind of excited uh in early access for fifa 20 thinking that the game had the ability to maybe become a relatively good game and then within the first two weeks everybody got on the game the servers went to hell and then within a couple of weeks after that ea released like four or five patches that completely ruined the game made shooting impossible and made defensive ai overpowered right and now we all remember how horrendous fifa 20 gameplay was so i am not going to sit here and start complimenting ea on um on gameplay but i will say that i'm kind of enjoying the grind right now of gameplay now is that a new game is that because it's early access is that because not a lot of people are on the game so the servers are relatively clean yeah could be all of those things uh above but as of right now i like where the game is at and i'm hoping that ea works to improve the things that are still issues the bounce backs for manual defending are still a problem um you know there are quite a few glitches in terms of dribbling and there are some issues here and there but once again dare i say the bones of the game are semi-decent right now and and here's hoping that it continues so let's just move on um to the grind uh what we're going to be doing here i guess we're going with the bear uh, is we've got more qualification and placement matches now we've got what two or three days left uh, for squad battle reward so as a reminder to you guys make sure you get your five placement matches in big coin rewards there if you win five straight placement matches games you get 120k if you win four and like draw or lose one you get like 80 or 90k right if you lose all of them you still get 10 or 20 000 coins so get those in and then the recommendation beyond that is to play squad battles so club anthem um okay pitch trophy shot blocker dead but whatevs all right uh and all of this stuff i'm not going to be focusing on too heavily for me today it's going to be about playing one or two qualification games and then also playing maybe one or two squad battle games because i i, I just want to see how things feel um uh, against the ai there you go we got that achieved what do you get out of that oh god all right that's kind of cringe not going to be going for that maybe as a stadium trophy the trophy that's kind of cool. I do like the coins on the pitch. That's hilarious. I'll definitely be going for that. We've got a coin emote on Twitch, so why not? And then when it comes to foundations, here you go. We've got some basics set up. Very simple things for any type of road to glory, whether it's a poor man or a rich man. I would be working through all of this stuff. 
Uh, very nice way to just set up the basics for your club. Uh, and then chemistry. We got two out of the three done here too. That's fantastic. 150 coins there. Um, and another 150 and then a sniper, which is, I mean, snipers aren't going for a, a single thing either. So another question that someone asked me before we get into it is, uh, Nick, what do you think about doing gold upgrade packs right now? And Honestly, I implore you guys to stay the hell away from untradeable packs if you are running any type of Road to Glory. Um, I know that you're going to look at some content creators packing a couple of good players, but you've got to think of the numbers, okay? Just say that each player, each gold player is 400 coins, right? Each gold two player pack is going to cost you 4,400 coins at minimum, right? At minimum. And that's if you're if if you are only getting rid of discard players, right? There are a lot of non rares that people don't even pay attention to that are worth anywhere from seven hundred coins to four or five thousand coins. So you could really be getting rid of a lot of liquid coins. So at the, at the bare minimum, let's say forty four hundred uh, coins per two player upgrade pack. If you just open ten, that's forty four thousand coins at the start of the game, man. If you put forty four thousand coins, which I did. Um, just from web app grinding and profits into players, those coins right now would be like 150k, 200k. So I beg, if you're running any type of Road to Glory, don't get caught down the rabbit hole of doing infinite upgrade packs. When it comes to team of the year, three, four months into the game, we all have our coins established. We all have decent clubs. We all have tradable coins. We all have um, uh, uh, a nice pool of coins to pull from. At that point, for Project Team of the Year, which we'll be doing again, so start of December, starting to build up upgradable packs for a Team of the Year pack opening is fine. That makes sense, right? You you throw some money, you throw your untradable players into that type of stuff just at a chance of getting a fun Team of the Year. I think it makes sense. But within the first one or two months, I'm getting that as a very consistent question from people is whether or not you should be getting rid of your useless players into upgrade packs. It is of my opinion, at the very least, that you either, you do one of two things. You either sell those players or you discard those players. That's it. That's it. And then when it comes time to it, you can put those players as well into like the advanced upgrade SBC packs. The, the good thing with the upgrade SBC packs though, is you can build those teams and then just do the loyalty glitch. So there is no real reason to hold anything in your club right now. If it's tradable, I would discard or sell. And then when it comes time to you wanting to do the advanced SBC, let's say you got 10K or something like that, then go build the advanced SBC to the cheapest possible way you can. And just make sure that you've got the, 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 the chemistry. And then if you need the loyalty, right? The extra one uh, bit of chemistry on each player, then you go do the loyalty glitch. It takes you five or 10 minutes and boom, you're done to go. So that would be the best way uh, to go about things in at least my uh, most humblest of opinions. Mr. Matt HD with 71 months. God bless brother. The king of the gold two player upgrade packs. Matt, you and your pack luck from gold two player upgrade packs is actually what started this entire conversation, my dude. Uh, Toddy HMK, appreciate it, man. <clears throat> uh, where did my monthly sub go? It, it was there, bottom left. Bottom left, bro. We've got all new alerts on the channel now. Um, uh, thanks to Mr. Lu so this guy's untradeable, untradeable, untradeable. So we'll keep all of those. I don't need a PSV. Ajax only, right, guys? Um, okay, and then Club Anthem Pack. I don't know what the hell this is. So we are... We are going to be ripping packs and stuff like that. We're going to do it a little bit later in the epi. I think what I'd like to do right now, though, is because we're on console, I would love... To do one of two things i think it's probably best for us to play some games but before that let me show you guys what we're rocking with here okay um so you can kind of see the stadium theme developing in the background i'm starting to piece together uh, a stadium that's going to work with our charity stream so for the charity stream all of the club themes club anthem player kits as we do every single year will be all pink so we've got kind of a, a pink theme set up once we get access to the full game we'll start working on that so this is what we're starting with right now. I've got a lot of investments on players. Uh, next episode or the episode after, I'll probably start showing you guys where uh, where the investments are going. I mean, even right now, the purchases of uh, Allen, I'm up like 50 to 100% on him. Uh, Alfonso Davies, I'm up like 10 or 20K. Uh, Hernandez was a lucky pack pull. Gomez, I'm up 10 or 15k on. Obviously, De Bruyne doesn't really matter. He's pack pulled. Um, and then for a discard, I, I was thinking of testing this guy out today. 
four star three star isn't amazing but as a discard inform i'm feeling like a lot of you guys might be looking at him just to put your coin somewhere again if he doesn't go up in price who cares you could just discard him for 10k and then you've got him as a usable player as well um he looks good looks pretty great to me uh he'll be as our left cam for the time being uh we're going to continue using Aubameyang and then we're going to get some proper use out of Nene and De Bruyne. so what we're going to do start of the game is I'm going to bring on Christian Eriksen for uh this handsome man uh for Mr. Andre Gomez I'm going to show you guys the custom tactics as well I'm being a little bit boring this year uh in that i'm kind of doing the exact same thing i did last year and just seeing where i i feel the team is like how how things are uh are going so i think i'm doing that that's kind of what i was running last year last year i think i did press on possession loss but for the time being i'm just keeping it on balance uh, i will say in the couple of games that i've played uh high press pressure after possession loss and pressure on heavy touch and constant pressure absolutely do not burn your stamina uh the two guys i played and you might even see uh in the next game that we play everybody's running high press and people's teams just run around all games spamming press and uh there's absolutely no punishment at all to their stamina you can pick them apart one twos and sending players in on net but in terms of stamina punishment where like in the 60th minute their team's dead kind of the way it was last year that's not a thing right now so i don't know if ea are gonna patch that or fix it or or, or whatever who, who knows but for the time being we are sticking to a four two three one so nene will be the creative cam mr bowen will be the right center mid um in like let's say a gareth bale position uh alan is gonna be our right dm alan is fantastic uh kdb i don't know what to really do with him uh obviously he's a big ticket item so this is maybe giving you guys advice uh that it, it isn't gonna help oh you know what no nene is our central cam oh so maybe i'll use wide left maybe we'll use bernardo silva then instead do i want to use nene wouldn't nene be wasted wide left we got to use him central right i think that'd be a bit idiotic to use them wide anyways um so the striker i'm gonna do stay central uh stay forward and nothing else nene is pretty much balanced everywhere uh i i don't know i don't i don't think there's much else i need to do other than maybe uh stay on the edge of the box for crosses i'd like him to stay like top of the box to be available for a uh, for a shot uh bowen so the wide players the way i used to do it last year is i had that pretty uh pretty crazy that's kind of what i did with my wide players so come back get into the box free roam so they go all around the pitch and then conservative interceptions uh alan is going to be stay back cover center nothing else and um mr kdb is going to be get forward and cover center and nothing else and then fonzie for the time being is going to be stay back and uh trent is going to be stay back i like Semedo more than trent Call me a pace whore all you want, I suppose. Uh, but so far, I'm liking uh, Semedo more than Trent. Whether or not it's because of the pace, uh, I'm, I'm not entirely sure. So that is the squad we're going to be running with for the next little while, at least until Aubameyang and, uh, and, and Trent expire. And then I think Richarlison will go in for Aubameyang and Semedo will go in for uh, Trent Alexander-Arnold. So without further ado let's get ourselves into uh, a game so can we go three wins in three oh, we'll get marcelito in here as well um i guess marcelito and a uh league uh okay i don't think i have a league uh wait manager contracts oh yeah of course I'm, I'm out of my mind contracts are still a thing well i'm an idiot for some reason i thought that was uh fitness okay we don't have league so it's okay nene will play on seven chem for the time being i don't really think that's going to affect him all that much um so we should be uh we should be just fine there now i'm thinking we'll be able to get games pretty quick with everybody trying to do their placement matches uh another thing i tweeted about i don't know if you guys can see right here look at that ping Bro, last year, I would get 20 to 40 ping, which I thought was already kind of good. Now, in all of my games, I'm anywhere from 4 to 9 ping. So, is that a 
Oh my god, uh, this poor guy is going to be so mad coming up against my team. Um, is that a glitch? Is that because hardly anybody's on the game? I, I have absolutely no clue. Uh, that's the first thought process. The second thought process, and when it comes to this, is... I, I'm still so irritated. It's 2020, almost 2021, and EA think in their infinite wisdom that it's still right for someone to quit on a draw and you don't get anything for it. That is still a glitch. Can you believe that? Fully a glitch. Ridiculous. So, someone pausing and quitting on you now? Is this guy going to do it as an example? No, I think he's, uh, I think he's making subs. But you don't get anything, um, which I find hilarious. So who could he be bringing on? Luka Modric, maybe? Um, as a loan? Perez, maybe? It's the new server locations. A lot of people are saying that, man, but I, I don't know. We'll have to see. I mean, I'll tell you right now, even with 20 and 40 ping last year, there was very heavy button delay and, uh, and server and gameplay lag. So I don't think ping really means anything. This is how the hosts will begin the game today. Space here. Oh, I should have made a sub. Alright. Bit of work here. You can notice these uh, kind of pulling. Can we apologize? I got to apologize to the poor guy. We'll apologize and skip. Uh, another issue as well, I find, guys, is that... Um, uh is that leads don't have badges like is that another glitch or did ea lose all the rights to every team's badge i what about your guys's teams are you noticing that the player uh, that the kits don't have any badges no team has badges so what is that did ea without telling anybody lose all the image rights to to in-game badges see i don't know how to call for a pass there because r1 Oh, unlucky. Great ball. Good tackle. High press, high press. See, pressure after possession loss might be the move, man, until they patch it. I think if I had pressure after possession loss there, I would have got the ball back very easily without even having to try. Are you serious? Okay. Sure. I mean, I guess he does have 82 pace. My God. Fair play, sir. Fair play. What a, like, a, a, an unsuspecting ball. That's Andre Gomez, isn't it? Oh, God. we got to make a sub here. Should use Ansu Fati. What am I thinking? Handball. Handball, ref. That was in the Premier League. That'd be a handball. I think he's offside too. Oh, Dios mio! All right, you know what? Let's uh, let's get uh, let's get that get that substitution made. Um, oh, Erickson, and then you know what? Sommer for Ulrich might be a good uh, a good replacement too. Handballs on foot would be absolute chaos. Oh no, absolutely! I was I was just purely kidding there. Like I I yeah. Would be would be nuts. Be terrible. Bigness. Oh, oh, man, that felt very. That's poor for me, to be honest. Um, very very poor. Oh my God, these manual blocks! Holy God, dude! I gotta go for that extra... Oh, Trent is out of position. I gotta go for that extra... Um, is this guy really gonna just have two chances and score two? Almost think he deserves it. Guy's a good defender. Give him that. Andre Gomes. I don't know. I've lost the plot, guys. Bro, how? 
good refereeing to let the play flow. Alan. I mean, uh, ain't, ain't nobody stopping that. Ain't nobody stopping that. So you got to do the extra beat there, boys, I think. You got to do the extra, the extra beat. I don't think we're going to be doing all that well. Um... If I uh, if I sit there trying to constantly shoot in front of the guy's Your defenders, the let's go. Allen is crazy. Allen is very overpriced right now, and he'll probably be overpriced for the next month. But he, is, I mean, he backs up the price tag at least. For anybody wondering about, uh, is this guy gonna score from kickoff? Conceded yesterday from kickoff too. And now Kevin De Bruyne. And they keep the ball moving. And Neymar. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball. Huh. And he okay. Did. I don't know how to. I don't know what to think about that, man. I feel like that was a relatively uh, well put together pass. His players looked all over the place, and yet they recovered beautifully. I need to. I think I need to fix my right analog player selecting. That's ridiculous. Again, I do find it kind of mad how I seem to struggle against people in terms of creating chances, but these guys just pass through me like my players don't exist. Let's go, Nene. What a ball, my son. Erickson. I saw one here. Wow, what a save, Merritt. Beautiful play. Oh, he was offside anyways. Wow, all right. Okay, so I will say this. Chip balls feel like they're back. Chip balls feel like they're back. Um, that's what, the second or third chip we've scored in, in two or three games? I thought it was going off the post. If this was FIFA 20, that would have been either wide or off the post. Or high. Uh, FIFA 20, you score like one out of a hundred chip attempts. But that's good. I mean, I like that, man. If I'm in a position like that and he has the audacity to call out his keeper... Um, on an angle like that, I feel like you should be rewarded for chipping, no? Oh, he's a keeper mover. So he might have a bad team, but he knows what's up. He definitely, uh, definitely knows what's up. I haven't figured out headers. I've conceded headers, but... I'm sorry. What the heck? What an, what an interception. Oh, my God. I keep pulling Trent so far out of position, man. Trying to be De Bruyne. That 13 button click attempts there. No De Bruyne. Selection. That's a goal. Bro, what in the hell? All right. Some mad bounces going on. De Bruyne. I don't think I'll be able to even get across halfway. Wow, what? Okay, there we go. <clears throat> this guy overplays his press all the time. You get 50 meters with his passes. Really? Um. Uh, okay, let's try Bernardo instead of Bowen. Bowen's been okay. He's missed, what, one or two chances? I think Bernardo with that uh, four-star weak foot might be handy to have. I'm moving Neymar out wide because Ericsson is just utterly useless out there. <clears throat> I, I think Allen is worth the price for sure. I do. I feel like actually in terms of the midfield, he's probably the star of the midfield right now. Look at my custom stadium. Isn't it cute? I love it. We get an F cancer spam in the Twitch chat and the YouTube comments. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Uh, I also haven't figured out how to tackle. Uh, I feel like the FIFA 20, like, sh uh, jockeying into someone is absolutely not the greatest way to do it. Players don't really do anything. And that's not a bad thing. I, I like that you have to commit to a tackle to win the ball back. That's that's all, that's all right. Um, see what I mean? Considering how awful this guy's team, it's kind of crazy what his AI is doing off the ball for him defensively. I feel like I'm constantly turning into like a, a high pressing AI defender. It's offside. What? 
Okay. What am I witnessing? Thank God he bottled that. A sloppy pass. That's a great ball. Erickson. Now with Aubameyang. Weighted ball from That is... Yeah, that's not what I wanted, but... Okay. Stefano Okaka. Mario Fernandez on the ball. Dude, what, man? Oh, thank God. Bro, what on earth are these chances? Brother is just passing it into me and getting in on net. Crazy. Considering the type of players I have, I find that a bit obnoxious. I'm sure I'm I'm not good defensively. What the hell is... Okay. You know what's kind of mad is... Uh, you know how, like, in FIFA 20, you... Realistically, you weren't comfortable even with a 2 nothing lead unless you're someone that just parked the bus. Like, if you played my style of football where it's just attack, 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 even at a 2 nothing lead, you're not comfortable. I would argue that in FIFA 21, and it's not a bad thing. I'm not saying it's a bad thing, but I, I would say that you're not... I'm not even comfortable with a 3 nothing lead. Bro, like, what... God, bad play. I have no idea. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Offside? Doesn't even matter. Rafael AI just picks it up like it's nothing. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Let's go, Allen. Oh, good recovery. Oh, Nene with the run of dreams, man. Okay, so Nick, why are you... Okay, whatever, dude. I don't know, man. We're trying to be spicy here with Nene. It's not working out. Oh, that was erotic. Alright, I'm moist. I'm moist! Oh, Merritt! What the f... What the hell are these saves? Oh my god, dude. Alright. Hey, bro, considering what type of team this guy has, he's doing well, man. He's got Smolov and Stefano Okakachuka up front. I haven't even noticed his Modric. This guy's merit is on how many saves? Seven saves! <laughs> okay. All righty then. And the substitution will occur now. Look at this guy sweating it by moving the keeper all the way. I wonder, like, can you shoot from there? Okay, that's an AI block that's a bit obnoxious as well. I don't know if I'm a fan of that. Exactly, does Modric have uh, more pace than Aubameyang in possession of the ball? Bonzi out of position a bit too. So much time left in this game, man. Wow. I press this two nuts. It's two nuts. This is what I'm talking about, though. This is what I'm talking about, man. Oh, you click one button, bro, and it's it's that's GG. It's it's ridiculous. Great tackle, Joe. Great tackle. Okay, yeah, there we go. I just got to play it back into the space that Neymar uh, goes to. That's a foul. No? Oh, yeah, I guess he made contact. Okay. And played short. Alan. No foul. Joe Gomez. I'm erect. Oh! I'm trying to do the tiki taka, bro. This guy's team isn't really like giving up the space, though. Ah! Unlucky. Yes, and right back to him. That's still in the game is upsetting. And he's going to get a goal from it, too. Wow. Bit of manual defending there from Gomez. Wow. How am I missing that tackle? 
Let's go. Allen's had the game of his life. For sure. Now, it's a bit cheese that I got the ball back there, but to be fair, I did ball roll. <laughs> Bro, this guy's sitting there covering me manually with two defenders, R1 and X, and moving the keeper into the near post to make the save. This is the type of thing where I'm not upset because this guy's got a garbage team. But you can see he's a FIFA sweat. Like, he, he knows how to play this game. Oh! But can he save that, though? Oh, God! Nay, nay! Oh! Okay. We're fine. Just call me R9 Rye. It's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Just call me R9 Rye. Oh, God. Nobody showed Danny that clip because he's trying to save for Dino, and, uh, but he loves Neymar, too, so... No one show R9 ride that clip. Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> Tackle from behind? No? Okay. A bit silly for me. What do you guys think? Pressure after possession loss is the one? Definitely feels like it's meta. No, that was for KDB. Wow, these passes, man. These guys can hit the pass as well. Oh, my Lord. Um, Neymar's rainbow is much better than regular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 would, uh, I, would, uh, I would agree. I would agree with that one for sure. Um, I got to go look back at that as a highlight, man. Oh, my God. That was crazy, dude. Holy God. Neymar on a hat trick crazy another fun founder there you go dude i've i've played nothing but five founders um get moist boys uh, oh my god outrageous oh oh, oh my god <laughs> top net the best net boys let's go Mixing it up, uh, Air Japes and R9 Rye style, boys. Hell yeah, dude. That is beautiful. I think the FUT founder thing is a bug. Oh, is it? Damn, I wish I showed up as a FUT founder for everybody, considering this is a FUT founder account. All right, boys. So we're three for three currently. Um, is there any way I can change my um, club name and stuff like that? Why is that still something I've not been able to do, guys? Where do you even do that? Is it the basics? Oh, change club name, lol. Right there. Wait, take me there. Yes. I hate that you can only do this once a year, by the way. Do you guys not find that dumb? I find that silly, man. Going back to the uh, OG FIFA 13, FIFA 14 uh, club name setup. Well, I guess Squid FC was the first setup, but this was quickly the second one. Um, Nick 28T and 28. Get it? Top up managers. Oh, okay. Give me those 150 coins, dude. Love that. If I buy the standard edition uh, and then buy EA Play, will I be get, able to get 10 hours early access? You will absolutely be able to do that. Yep. Precisely what you'll be able to do. I want to do this, man. Complete five matches of any fuck game mode so, to unlock the seat color. I want that. Complete 10 matches. Complete 20 matches. Club nickname. This is cool though. 30 matches for club song. 40 matches. I think Nep would have all of this stuff, right? 50 matches to unlock your main stand right trophy as well. Oh, baby. You know we're going for all of this, boys. Okay. Should, do you guys want me to go into another one? Go for another uh, another game real quick. Trade Paul's kind of getting a little bit crazy. Let me uh, let me deal with this real, real fast. Um, so, 
man. I really wish I picked up this Rio. We were we were looking at uh, Rio sort of yesterday. Now he's yeah, that's mental. He's what like eight hundred now, eight hundred or eight fifty. 200k increase, man. Well, that's kind of interesting, though. Have a look at that one. All right, so we clear him. Uh, clear him. Uh, I was also looking at Bruno's. Dudes, what do you guys think about Bruno as a potential pickup? I was going to get him for like 280. I mean, yeah, he's definitely gone up in price, so that's too bad. I feel like I might have missed the window on him, man. Would have made like 50k profit on him yesterday. Bad. That is too bad. What I don't like about Informs too is a lot of the achievable grinding right now is for like gold players in your starting 11. So I want to try and get like my 15 wins first before I even start putting Informs and stuff into the team. <clears throat> but anyways. All good. 5.5. 5 sell for 5.5 so that's actually a kind of a good sign um 3.2 sell and one right there a milli flat for two days though that's not, i guess you'd argue that's probably the, the the cheapest option as of right now so we'll keep an eye on him virgil so virgil's up to what 570 now Something like that. Uh, o. Wilson, Tim, J. Herbs, Carter, Valhalla, Liam, Danny. Thank you, guys. Oh, and uh, real quick, too, dudes. We're looking at starting to test out some of the new icons, but I think I'm going to wait for a while with this Eric Cantona, man. I didn't realize he was such a beast. 6-2. Um, I wanted to use him as, like, a central cam to be a psycho to, like, create kind of where Neymar is like to create really cool opportunities but he, like I feel like if you're not using him as an outright striker after you score karate kick people and stuff like that like you're probably doing it wrong with Eric Cantona right we will definitely be testing out Eric Cantona but I think it's going to be um at striker like with how OP heading is and OP strong guys are this almost feels like a as a, a, a what a Zlatan icon will be down the road in terms of usability so he definitely seems fantastic but I think I'll be using him as my uh, as my uh, ST. So I was having a look at SCN five fifteen. I think that's a great price. Yep, I just cleared two hundred k. So we missed out on that. I was I was humming and hawing about that. Missed his bid. Um, Rio for six ten is a GG. I think he's seven hundred now. Um, not as good of a buy. Actually, that's a L, isn't it? Overbid. Uh, last year, one of our very good first pickups. Uh, was Laurent Blanc as well, but his price is nuts, dude. His price right now has already moved up to the price he was for like the rest of the year last year, which is kind of crazy. So icons are a bit concerning. I, 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 I'm doing some investing. And like I said, next episode, we'll probably show you guys the where and what we're investing in. Um, and then you can kind of have your own ideas. I think no matter what, any type of uh, in-demand player, if you're going to put an investment into them, you're going to do very well. I think personally, um, but at the same time, when you look at some of these guys' prices, like they're, they're nuts and it's hard to convince myself to go in on them, um, for the time being 4.3, 3.9, no bid. Wasn't there the one for 2.6? What did that go for guys? Remember the Cantona for 2.6? Where is he? That we were looking at this. I think it's right here. Oh, I think that was a good deal. I do think that was a good deal. Uh, Dino not even selling. There you go. 2.3 on Dino is kind of nutty. How much did this go for? So 900 no buy is maybe a good sign too for Laurent Blanc. I like that. Um, yeah, Rio for 850 is crazy when you could get him for 650. Um, I think this dude probably jumped the gun. Maybe paid a bit too much. I was just looking at Van Basten. I don't know, man. Again, for what 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 is considered the meta in this in this game right now, I think this Van Basten is going to be crazy too. I really do. I feel like these are the types of players that are really going to start shifting up in price. Uh, and Van Basten might be someone I, I look at. I know he only has three-star skills and medium-medium work rates, but 
the, dude, the meta is kind of having a big boy up top, man. Like, maybe that's why I like Richarlison over, and I'm not saying he's a big boy, but why I like Richarlison over at least uh, b the baby Jesus, right? Gabriel Jesus. Eric Cantona. Even, th even this card looks crazy. What a nuts card, even his baby. Man, can you imagine his moments card? How uh, obnoxiously fun it's going to be to use him? Um... Right card of someone I was looking at. He looks to be a really good CB again, early days. Uh, Bruno. Um, I was looking at this guy too, man. Price tag is mad. And there you go. In fact, the price tag seems to have gone down. Interesting, huh? What are we talking for uh, for Mane's price right now, dudes? Have a, let's have a look and see what the community is uh, is throwing on on bid for him. Uh, I don't have I looked at push gas. He does look good, but he's got isn't he isn't he four star four star or something silly? Wouldn't I, I, I mean, haven't I haven't obviously haven't watched push gas, but. Um, I mean, at least from those that know, it seems like that's a bit, a bit ridiculous. Oh no, sorry. It's even worse. He's four star, three star, isn't he? Yeah. He's four star, three star, which is kind of dumb. What's Ronaldo's striker at? Uh, I'll show you guys in one second. I just want to clear this stuff out. Yeah. Baby ice, man. There you go. 4.1 on bid. Uh, he'll be he'll be worth that price all year long. He's that good. Yeah, these are these are kind of the things we're looking at right now. Obviously, I don't have the coins for it, but um, it is what we are uh, what we're looking at. Transfer list of sales too. All right. Thank you. Still struggling to sell these guys because his... Oh! Did his price uh, range get updated, guys? Well, too late now to find out. That's for sure. Okay. We'll go look at the uh, player values and stuff like that. I I, I don't know if that really is going to matter all that much right now. I think I want to get into another game, boys. It's crazy that I don't have to worry about fitness, man. What a what a, what a little blessing that is. Just get on get on with it. He's 2K on Xbox. That's crazy. How do you access the club menus in chat? Uh, you go to stadium. So after this game, I'll show you. 15 ping. See, that's a concern. So does that mean 50 ping on the old setup or, or what? That's the, high, that's the highest ping we've had. Or again, is it all just visual? Does it even matter? Don't know. Oh my God. Okay. Uh, you guys maybe want to get ready, um, in terms of, uh, in terms of me getting clapped, boys. <laughs> Thomas, thank you, man. Appreciate the 33, brother. That's a nice setup. Zizu on loan? Welcome, everyone. Okay. On night for with the um, uh, I mean, I know, I, I understand I got Nene, Nene but it be interesting. And what we have coming up for you oh god is how is that not a foul this ought to be special well Derek, with a win last time out they're looking to push on if they really want to get placed in the higher division i'm looking oh forward to my god that's my fault i did that by accident game, Ooh, that thing is very weird i'm saying it's Jared terrible Bowen. okay let's name on how are you going to beat the player nick and cut back into danger you idiots my fault. Poor for me. I was using Zidane up top. Oh god. That's a What a manual block. Oh my god. Room to roam on the wing. What in what? And Gomez. I was gonna say, man! 
Oh my lord, this guy is, I mean, just like everybody else. Let's go, Nene. Go, Nene. Yeah, this guy, this guy is uh, very, 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 very aggressive um, defensively. So we should be able to make him pay here. Again, let's bring on Erickson. Let's bring on Sommer here in goal. There we go. Um, wow, what a block! What a manual block there from Gomez, huh? Holy dude, I I was ready to give away a pen there too. Crazy, crazy. I need to fix all of my like in-game stuff. Maybe. This guy's getting cheese right now. What are you doing, Nick? What am I doing right now? What is happening? I'm sorry, what is the meaning of life? Wow! Okay. I ha uh, ha. Uh is that gonna be a regular occurrence in this game, man? Is uh is, is downward header still the same thing, guys? Uh, L1 R1. Gotta get better at manual heading. David Silva. Now Holland. Let's go. And pull back. Another pen. There you go. There you go. There you go. I'm trying to be spicy, dude. Okay? How the hell did he predict that? So a throw in here. Just leave me alone. There. Thank you, Jesus. That's a three-star weak foot. I think that's kind of deserved, man. This guy's got a pretty nuts team, too. So uh, I, I, I feel like that's a deserved result it should probably be quite a bit more let's go Nene let's go deserved deserved Aubameyang uh, look I'm going to say right now between Aubameyang and, and Richarlison I would go Richarlison every day of the week I would, man. Richarlison with a sniper is ten times the player that Aubameyang is with a uh, with a marksman. I, 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 I th th that's at least my my initial thoughts on it. Erickson's kind of trash too. Oh, what's up, boss? How you doing? Oh, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. I'm so excited. Thank you. <laughs> Wish I could tell you guys what the boss just showed me, chat. Damn it. Feels feels very much like a FIFA 20 thing. <laughs> Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Alan. Spoke a bit too soon, boys. Alexander Arnold. It's with Alan. How defend this guy's losing 3-1. Look at how many players he has behind the ball. Hey bro, we're not playing FIFA 20, my guy. Opportunity. Get absolutely pissed on, sir. I'm gonna apologize because Neymar is too spicy with it! Oh my god! I hate how there's no badges! Fix that! I wanna see that beautiful Leeds badge, man. Oh. Oh, yeah, you can skip replays. I don't mind that, by the way. I think you should be able to skip Sellies, too. I think you should be able to skip Sellies. That 
touch. I mean, thank you. That might be the first time in, in FIFA in a while where you go to shoot the ball in the net and the guy fouls you from behind, but you don't perfectly fall over that it's given as a pen. What the f Wow, thank you, baby. I appreciate you very much. Wow. Chat is mucho impresto. You didn't eat your cookies. Huh? Yeah! Thank you, baby. Sorry, I had a pen with Nene, babe. GG. Nene's run-up is so annoying, too. I feel like it gives your opponent so much time to figure out where you're going. And if the guy's stream sniping, because Neymar takes so long, he just, he'll be able to watch the stream and see where I'm going. Okay, so you still click R1, but it's, I don't know, it's very clunky. That ball, though. I'm not getting there, but that, that was a really nice play. Oof. Man, would you guys say Sommer was kind of the man of the match here? Let's go, Trent. Bonzi and Sommer and Allen feel like, uh, well, Gomez blocked like two or three for sure goals, too, so. Feels like, even though I'm winning 5-1, it feels like a, a decent defensive display from the boys. Nah, it's my fault. Oh, and again. Wow. Manual defending OB. Oh, wow. I love it. I love video games. <laughs> oh, God. Hey, the second you see them pull the keeper to cut the passing lane down or the shooting lane down, chip it. I don't know if that's going to get patched, but chipping it seems like, like it was in FIFA 11, man. In a good way. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh, it's... I think I've scored an average of five to eight goals in these qualification games. I think a lot of people are going to be complaining, though, man. And you know what? Just like FIFA 18 when it was hard to defend and there was an actual skill gap in defending, everybody complained so that EA patched and it ruined FIFA 18. And it was quickly becoming one of the best gameplay games ever. I really hope that the community doesn't just sit here crying endlessly. <laughs> Now, am I saying that also because I'm using some high-end players? Aubameyang, Mene, De Bruyne, Allen, Gomez. Yeah, that, that Ericsson's body shape was all wrong there. Um, all right. Brazil, Germany, boys. There we go. Beautiful. So we are four wins from four games in qualification. We are one win away from 120, what, 9,000 coins? Bro, that's crazy. People think prices are are, are, uh, are expensive right now. Bro, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm telling you, at 17 shots. I'm creating the exact same amount of opportunities as I was last year. The difference is this year, I'm scoring five, six, seven goals. Whereas last year, I would create exactly that many opportunities and score one goal, maybe two. Maybe two. Or score none and lose one nothing or two nothing. The two counterattacks. Um But uh yeah. So far so far so spicy, boys. I, I will I will say that. So far so spicy. I'm uh I'm I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. So we got one more game. Uh whether or not we save it for tomorrow, I don't know. Early access, what's that? Play four matches in Rivals, containing at least three players bought from the transfer market. Okay. Good. I love that. Small gold player. Oh, baby. All right. Nothing that. that. Score a finesse shot in two separate Rivals matches. Really? Have I only scored one finesse shot out of all those goals? All right. I don't know. Finesses never seem to be really that great, so I guess I've, like, trained myself to not click R1 while shooting too often. Um... We got some foundations to update with here, too. Play. Rivals matches. Huh? 
Earn 500 weekly score. Ooh, coin bonus, dudes. October's if you run out of time, make sure you uh make sure you try and get this as quickly as possible for October 6th onwards. That'll be a nice uh what another 2500 coins for your road to glories. That's good. That's good. I like that. Very nice. Yeah, this friendly stuff I'll worry about closer to October 6th. Um co-op, we'll worry about this closer to October 6th. We'll probably do some of this with like Armalika, maybe Zwei Nep. I don't know. We'll see. Squad battles. Squad battle single player mode that matches you, whatever. Okay, we gotta do a squad battle and top up contracts. I mean that shouldn't be a problem. I think everybody's probably getting close to uh to running out of contracts, right? Yeah, everybody's uh everybody, everybody's in the same spot. Oh, that's cool. So R1, was this always a thing where you click R1 and it uh, instantly switches you over somewhere else? Like that. Yeah, that's kind of hot. Okay. Um, have you noticed that... Uh... Oh my god, okay. Oh, I don't want that. Anyways. Uh, I'm, I'm undecided. So what's DeBrina looking like for in three games for us, guys? Three games, one goal, one assist from box to box mid. Do you guys think that De Bruyne is kind of wasted in that position? Nay, nay. Look at Neymar. Oh my God. Welcome to manual defending and people not knowing how to defend. Three games, ten goals from Cam. <laughs> oh, crazy, dude. Two assists only is probably the biggest concern, I would say. Aubameyang had, may have scored two goals in three games, but I think he's missed like ten tap-ins. So that's a concern. I still think Richarlison is better. Um, Bowen, one goal, one assist out of two games. I guess that's okay. Allen, man, from a holding DM, bro. Uh, how much is he nowadays? I think he's like 55, almost 60K, right? 83 rated player for 55, 60K is kind of crazy. But um, for 40K, I feel like he's worth it for sure. Um... I don't know. He's 65k? Good God. <laughs> this market. And it's only going to go up, boys. I mean, yesterday people were doubting me saying it was going to go up. Dude, wait till... I'm going to say this right now. For anybody that's still paying attention to this as an episode for YouTube, you do realize that the coin boosts in, in qualification games are a big reason why the market is even crazier than last year at the start of the game. This is only 1% of the community right now that is even achieving those coins because they're on early access. Wait till October 6th. More importantly, wait till October 9th. Wait till October 12th. Wait till October 15th when the, the, the regular Timmies and Tom, Dick, and Harrys get the game and then get their few qualification games in. And your average FIFA player is getting anywhere from 10 to 50,000 coins to start with, dude. People think the market is expensive right now. It's going to go up way more than that, in, in my opinion um at least so if you're sitting on coins you're doing yourself a disservice you do you need to be picking up players and i, I mean any players that have within your price range a a uh um a demand whether even it's an eric by or a mendy or a Semedo or a maybe not bernardo silva i don't know even know if bernardo silva is really going to be that in demand but even at this point an Allen, a Hernandez, dude, these prices are going to be nuts. They're going to be absolutely nuts. They're crazy right now, and it's only going to get more more crazy. Yeah, I think maybe we put... Um, we haven't seen Bielsa on the field, hey? I, I'm not seeing managers at all. Has anybody been able to see Bielsa on the field? I haven't been paying attention. I bought 25G Bamans already. That's a great shout. Uh, Wilfred and Didi as well um i think would be great too i don't know i don't know if you guys agree or disagree with that but i, I think uh indeedies those types of players would be fantastic i see klopp on mine companies on the field so wait was that all false advertisement where we saw pictures of bielsa on the field in game i have them we've played one home game two away games Try to hug him next game. Okay. 
Maybe I'll maybe I'll run to Mr. Uh, Marcelo. Marcelo. Um. Okay. Yeah, like even the Neuers, man. Up until yesterday, Manu Neuer wasn't even expensive. Um. Career mode and offline games. Wait, but then why do a manager's other managers show in online games? Or at least they did last year. Right? Maybe they maybe they don't this year anymore at all. Maybe you don't get cutscenes with managers at all. Okay. Some of you guys might be pissed with this. Um, I really want to test out because we only have two or three days left, boys. I really want to test out um, my uh, squad battle stuff. Okay. So I want to see on Legendary if I'm going to get clapped just like everybody else. It seems to be the case. Wait, where is squad battles? Did I miss it? Wait. Oh, Squad Battles is the first one. All right. Um, is, is this a nightmare, guys? I'm going to do uh, Legendary. There we go. Oh, my God. Am I going to take my first L against the AI? Is that, uh, is that the reality? Um, wait, can I not quality filter? There we go. That's a nice addition. They, they added it into the game last year, but absolutely a fantastic addition. Oh, you guys see a little investment there. Didn't want you to see it, but you did. Got a little sneak peek into some of my investments. Did you get a look at that quick, uh, flash of some icons? Moist. Moist is, oh my God. I love that. There's no fitness. Crazy. All right, so we'll bring on uh, Ansu for Gomez. And then if Neymar needs a break, um, we'll bring in... Uh... See, why the Leeds badge is right there. Why is it not in game? Look, see it right there? It's, it's just not in game, which is ridiculous. Playing on nine right. It's way tougher. Not unreasonable, but tougher than last year. Oh, love is it Dad really? N28, love N28, love N28, love. Okay, okay, okay. I'll have to focus then, Quince. AI does Ronaldo chops and drag backs. Oh, God. Okay. Um, so we're talking like sweat mode against the AI? Uh, also, has anybody tested out if the, uh, the, the fake shot glitch works? The fake shot stop. Um, not that I'm going to bore you guys to death with doing this, like, during an epi, but, uh, well, I guess Armalika is going to cut out all the dead zones anyways, right? Maybe not live gameplay, but squad battle games, Armalika, we're just cutting it all out, right? And then I'll just show you guys, uh, uh, and then we'll, we'll just show you guys, I think in squad battles, we'll just show you guys for YouTube the, the result. Oh my god, what is this? Yeah, I, I, I think I have to focus, guys. Oh, God. Oh, God. I just pulled my... What is happening? This is... By the way, I, 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 I as a reminder, these are bronzes. Now we're away. Delay, man. Wait, is he in? He was in on net there! Things you love to see, boys! Beautiful! Okay. I, I was about to get pissed off because it took forever to release the pass, so I thought he was offside for sure. Save the complaints, Nick 28T. Save the complaints. Uh, what? I'm trying to play Aubameyang in on net. What is this game sometimes, dude? Oh, that high press, though. Late game. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Chances on. My fault. I was trying to feed Allen. GG, boys. Okay, so... Um, I believe this is probably where YouTube will come in. It's 8-0. 
I, I don't know if that shows the t it tells you guys the entire story here. We scored some really, really lovely goals. So I'm very happy with the performance. Neymar with two, Aubameyang with two, Bowen with two, Alan Fati. The reason why we I scored so many is because I kept forgetting to run to Bielsa to celebrate because I want to see him in the game. And then the one time I remembered, it, Erickson jumped in the way and blocked it. And made me celebrate with him on the bench instead of with Bielsa. So I actually don't know if Bielsa shows up on the field. I haven't seen him. But that is the telling story. I had to make like four wonder blocks to not concede. And then even then, bronze like 50 chem AI players still managed to create four chances. And held 59% possession with 93 pass accuracy, dude. How? That is, it's just crazy. So... Long story short, um, I would definitely say that uh, Legendary is way harder this year. And that, that is just with... I'll show you guys the team real quick too, so you get a bit of an idea uh, of, uh, of what we're looking at here. Let me, uh, let me show you guys what the team looked like. Where is it? View Squad. Here we go. Okay, so it's not full bronzes, but nevertheless. Like this guy, dude was skilling me to death crazy look at that the guy's got 70 agility bro 73 dribbling you skilling me off the park nuts anyways um so all good i think the difficulty is going to come here and here on legendary bro against ronaldo oh my god yeah, so I feel like the difficulty is going to come from games like this. So I'll show you... Uh, maybe I will... I, I think I'm going to play uh, another game. Where are we at? Armalika, I know we're editing out the, the, the squad battle gameplay. So we're at, what, an hour and 40 minutes of recording time. This epi's probably like an hour and 10, an hour and 20. So do you think we can play one more game and then finish the epi with some packs? Are we okay for that? I think we're all right, right? Uh, match, thank you for the 26, man. Uh, uh, Aquardian, J Woods, appreciate you guys. And yeah, that's true too. The timeouts can go to the gulag. So I kind of let's test that. Let's test it against this team. Let's test it against this uh this setup. Obama Yang's final game. A lot of you guys would think maybe I would want to use him for uh my final. Uh, qualification game which we'll do for tomorrow's epi so we'll, tomorrow we'll get to see uh how many coins we get from our qualifications as of right now with four wins where are we at like are we at, gonna get at least like 50 60 70k from qualifications i think we'll be division four maybe even division three which is ridiculous as well to start the year out you're gonna get 89k minimum nuts that is crazy what a nice kit, hey, that France kit is. Love that. Don't you guys love being able to just go into game after game after game as well? Isn't that great? Um, all right. Let's get it. The Elsa? Yeah. I'm going to eat too. Since none of this makes YouTube, I'm eating. Joining me for commentary on this game. Alright. Uh, thoughts on waiting to get Xbox Games Pass with EA Play? Um. Uh, if you don't care about 10 hours early access, then sure. Squirrel, thank you for the five, brother. Appreciate you. Wow, so it was a request too. That's, I mean, I respect you for having the balls, Artie, to, to admit that, but that's outrageous. Absolutely outrageous. I'm glad someone requested a timeout for that mad message. I 
I assume you've done all the SBCs? No, not yet. Mm. I start working on all the SBCs um, as of October 6th onwards. When me and Armalika can work together doing like share play. Um, like so we c I can just build a squad just by buying the players off the market and then doing the 10 games um, glitch for five or five or 10 minutes or whatever. You know, that type of that type of stuff. Um, no, no, no. Four dollars and above, D McGraw. Four dollars or four hundred bits and above. I'll look at squads, but just not while I'm recording for YouTube. Tip two is hard. Oh, I believe that. Precious time in the game. Oh, well. Five minutes wasted. So be it. I'm fucking starving. I like this guy's team name. Tommy Damane. <laughs> Alright, Salmer. Another big performance, my guy. Get it. Trying to stay zen. And I haven't eaten since yesterday at like 6 p.m. So I'm fucking starving. It's almost noon. My damn 18 hour fast is a bit, a bit ridiculous. Yeah, we got it. I, I forgot. We, I really have to focus here. Why can't I fucking select the player I want? This is how it looks for the home side. Kasper Schmeichel is the going to be easier or harder? Oh, my Nelson Lord. Semedo in the wide defensive areas and so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Wow. Wow. Okay, Pierre Emmerich. I see you, baby. <laughs> Shaking that ass. Good stuff, dude. Can they come up with a quick reply? Nice. Jared Bowen, Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. No potential danger. Excellent defending. I don't know. I don't know if I should be playing that pass. <laughs> Bruno Fernandes. Bro, you give Ronaldo one chance, he's scoring. Back to the keeper, but couldn't. And Aubameyang sucks at passing. Oh, what was the keeper doing there? Oh, God, Cristiano. Oh, my God, Cristiano has the man bun. Nightmare. Oh, no. Oh. oh, my God. 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 CR10. Oh, God, CR10. Oh, Jesus! How about the cross? Gattuso. Ronaldo. Dude, what the hell is this Cristiano Ronaldo, dude? Bro, am I gonna have possession at all? And they are on the move again. Yes. Okay, so it is... Wow. Okay, dude. I was about to say it's all about being patient. I thought that was a very simple pass. I don't know how De Bruyne bottles that. What can they do to stop him running at them? This guy's got song. Oh god, am I gonna get copyrighted for that trash? Wait, it's still playing. Oh, I wonder if that. I wonder if that's now something YouTubers will have to be worried about copywriting. Really 
You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, he stepped up to the plate to get that goal to put his team on equal terms. Thank you, Nene. Wow. Wow. I that's crazy. It's this is this is nuts. It's too hard. I'm not I'm, I'm just not good enough at this. Really. Um Do, 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 do. I love that. I love that viewers can request the timeouts for stupid comments. Great. Great. Goal for the visitors. Number 10, Neymar. Tuzo on the ball. The host have had the lion's share of possession. After that, it's been a little bit disappointing. From here, do I do I do I go one depth drop back? Like I, I have no idea. Goal. Need to get wide, need to get crosses in the box. Alert defending. Alexander Arnold. Love that. Love that. Love that overlap from Alexander Arnold. One more. No! What? Erickson, you suck. Did you guys see that run that Aubameyang was on? Why did he not make that pass? Oh, my God. Holy shit! Pat Ronaldo sold him and got full Ooh. Liverpool squad. Thank Just you for the dono. For God, oh, the alerts are so sexy. Was on my bench too. Thank you. Loving seeing you grind FIFA again. Much love, bro. Yeah, D, I'll have to look after, uh, after the epi, my bro. I'm sorry. Outrageous. Outrageous. R1 square is nuts. Okay, R1 square is if you got an opportunity like that, dudes, pile drive it. Pile drive it. Howland is crazy. The guy that I played that had Howland on loan uh, gave me a hell of a time. I don't want it. Let's go. Beautiful. It might be perfectly set up for the counter attack, you know. Wow. No chance for him to get in behind, maybe. All the door a broken counter I don't know what 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 just happened there. Very confused. Having some Sanchez. Very 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 confused. Little Yeri. Sanchez. Gattuso on the ball. What? Okay. Over the I'm gonna say. Um. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. I say, did it not like set? I don't know. I, I don't know. Defensively, I don't know what the what the hell I'm meant to do. I do not know how to defend to save my life. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel. Hey, there's Vincent Company. So wait, the AI. Oh my God, Vincent Company. That's awesome. <laughs> I love that. But where's Marcelito, man, with my subs? Why does he not show? That's so dumb. Hernandez. So 20 minutes to go. Oh, well done. That's back line is pretty okay. Man's just casually sitting here with a uh, Cristiano Ronaldo too. It's crazy. And uh, what was it? Gattuso as well. He's got Gattuso and Cristiano. Set up. No potential danger. Gattuso. I can't be. No, I need to be De Bruyne. No way. That's outrageous, dude. 
Now, five different analog clicks to try and be De Bruyne. It just would not let me be him. What a ridiculous pass as well. Ridiculous play, dude. Played the ball across goal through like four of my players for him to get that tap in. Across the keeper, too. Oh, God, dude. You know the AI is going to get another one, too. They're going to go high press. Man, I, I, I keep thinking the AI is going to overcommit. They, do, they just don't. This game is far from over, and the fans are certainly reminding them of that. Oh my god, Rashford's been subbed on too, Jesus. Well in. What a tackle. I, I'm clearly doing something wrong there, and I'm just... I don't know why. I feel like there's, a, there's an obvious passing lane that I want, and it's very rarely getting selected. Five minutes. Five minutes. Okay. All right, Marcus. You do you, brother. You do you. So I'm on drop back, and nobody is anywhere. I'm on defensive drop back, and my whole team's pushed up the field like a bunch of weirdos. Simple X pass. So one thing I'm noticing right now is whether you want to call it DDA, whether you want to call it a slider manipulation, whatever it is, man, it's very obvious that my team is brain dead right now. Everybody's standing around. I'm on one depth drop back, clicking R1 for my players to show for passes, and they're all just running up the field. So I have like one defender back. I don't know, man. Like that type of stuff, every other content creator will say, oh no, you're crazy. None of that's in the game. But like, well, then explain to me why my shape was perfectly fine up until the tail end of the game. Or up until my opponent got uh, one goal away. You know? Great defending, though. Good stuff. All right. Well, um, yeah. I, I guess suffice to say that legendary against good teams is a nightmare. I don't know if I would go as far as saying it's not fun. But it is annoying. Um, and I don't know how to feel about it. I feel like as the game progresses, I don't know how much uh, squad battles I'll play. Like, it's just ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Like, I feel like that'll this game was harder than 90% of Foot Champs games I'm going to play for the first two months. Um, so, it is what it is. I, I, I will reiterate that you, if you are able to play a team this good with whatever squad you have, a god squad or otherwise, if you're able to 5 nothing a team like this, with the tactics that they employ, with how broken some of the mechanics can end up being, I seriously think you're like a Division two, Division 3 or Division 2 player, easily a Gold 1, maybe even Elite 3 player. Um, that was crazy. I barely got away with a 3-2 win there. So, anyways, um, I am going to grind squad battles a little bit to try and get some good squad battle rewards for, uh, I believe it will be Sunday. So for Monday or Tuesday's Epi when I'm back. But... Yeah, it's kind of mad. I would say it's good practice, though. If you don't feel confident with the game and you don't want to go online and, and get slapped up in Division Rivals and have people celebrating and being toxic, um, just going going into squad battles against Legendary AI is truly um, a nightmare. It, it, it is. In, in the best possible way I can describe it. So that is, in terms of gameplay, the end of it for us. Again, you two probably only seeing the uh, the highlights. Let's go. We got seat color, boys. Uh, another thing that is a common question is people always are asking me how you change kits and stuff on console. So on web app, it's obviously very easy. There we go. We got squad battles done. Oh, we got a silver pack, boys. We ball in. Let's go. Good. I like that nice and a bit extra xp too love it uh something else in foundations that i must have missed here we go single player win a squad battle bang bang don't mind if i do i'm i'm a weirdo i, li I like having seats be upgradable and stuff i, I like i like uh, i like the stadium being customizable we're going full pink boys full pink for the f cancer charity stream 25 golden passes 
assists 25 times. I've already got 25 assists in like six games. Wow. In six games. See, and again, I love that, man. I don't want that to go away, dude. I don't want the games to feel like real football games where it's barely one or two nothing or or one or one one or zero zero or barely two one wins. I want to see stuff like this, man. I want I want high end goals. I I want lots of goals. I mean, obviously it's gonna be annoying if you've got like a three nothing lead and you end up losing to a guy five three, but. Do, do you not want that though to be down three or four nothing and still know that if you just focus you can easily come back? I don't know. I um I kind of like that personally, at least. Oh my god, yeah, we're gonna have to get that pitch uh, transfer mastery. Definitely, definitely gonna have to get that. That'll we'll we'll get that in no time. Upgrade, but that's like one of the final upgrades to the stadium. Okay, so before we jump on to some uh, uh, some packs, I think I want to show you guys where to do it. So you go see see at the bottom where it says stadium. You click up, hold up, and then this is where you go and change kits and everything. So match day, this is where the kits are. I still haven't found a ball that doesn't look like it's uh, a yellow ball that doesn't look like it's floating. We're just sticking with the terrible FIFA uh, or EA ball. Uh, the charity stream kit. So I was thinking this one for the charity stream. What do you guys think? And then maybe this one is the away one. Kind of looks hot. What do you guys think? Is there a better F Cancer uh, like pink looking kit than this one? Don't know. I'm thinking for the charity stream that's going to be the one. So for the next few days, in the lead up to it, we are going to go with that um show respect so goal song we don't have club nickname we don't have crowds though so club anthem we unlocked um is there a leeds club anthem guys someone let me know if the, i like that you can hear it um someone let me know if there's a lead leeds club anthem so or or something cool like that anyway sidelines main stand trophy so we got nothing for sidelines structure there it is. So, um, seats. Do we have magenta seats? Oh my god. How beautiful is that for the charity stream, boys? Oh, I love it. Look, for like team of the year, bros, we'll go gold and blue. Uh, you know, for, for probably for the rest of the year, I'll probably go like black and purple, I think. Like black seats and then uh, purple stadium theme. How hot is that going to look? Hold on. Let's... uh. Blue and purple? No, 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 no. We're going like straight up purple. Where is it? Purple and yellow is kind of cool. Is there not just straight up purple? I thought there was. There. So purple and black for like my, my setup for obviously the stream theme and stuff. I think that's what we'll be going with. But there we go. So we're all purpled up. So again, um, it... Th so this stadium I can't customize. Is it only the Silver Futt Stadium that's customizable? That's one of the questions I had for you guys. Not many people have been able to answer for me. I understand the Johan Cruyff Arena you can't customize for legal reasons. But a stadium like this? Are you not able? Is it only the dead Silver Stadium? So we're all stuck with... We can't like increase stands and stuff like that down the road? That's crap. I don't know. I, I feel like that's a bit crap. But anyways... I do like that for the uh, the F Cancer theme setup. Um, also, I believe, where do you go for stadium theme? Is it here too? Badge. Where's the stadium theme? Uh, is it structure? Wait, where is the stadium theme? Well, I'm recording for YouTube, brother. I can't check your uh, squad yet. Wait, where is the stadium? You know we're like on the side of the packs? Is it, oh, is it crowds? Yeah, yeah. Stadium theme. So I will do leads normally, but I think I'm going to do pink as well here. What do you guys think? Should we go full magenta? What, what are we saying? Now nah, I think, I think we go for pie. Um, maybe we don't. Coral, how cool is that? You got like the black and white setup. You got Spain. 
Got orange. I mean, I'm assuming then you could go with like a Netherlands theme. I until we get magenta is not the one. Until we find a pink one, uh, we'll stick with the Leeds theme. I kind of like it too. It's kind of hot. Kind of awesome. It's kind of awesome. All right. Now uh, I feel like in terms of the packs, we are going to be getting an infinite amount of packs uh, to open. Of course, here. So I don't. I don't know if we care too too much to open them via console or via the web app i don't know does it does it matter all that much so that's not a walkout remember the three lines uh as the doors open lets you know whether or not it's a um eden hazard is not bad i do i can't wait man i can't wait to just get all these player tests you know each epi thanks to armalika being able to edit it right like each epi will start at 6 p.m and it'll be like a three or four hour recording and then he cuts it down to um uh uh, uh, one or two hour epi player reviews, 6 p.m. content packs, all of that stuff daily, right? You get the 6 p.m. content that we'd always review, anyways, on the poor man road to glory. Uh, a new squad, squad builder every day, or, or a new player review every day, depending, right? If there isn't like any new players released via objectives or anything like that, then we'll do a, uh, um, uh, uh, a, a whatever, a, a squad review. Which I'm very, very excited about. And then, uh, beyond that, as well, like, that realistically is, I can't believe I've been selling these for 900 coins. What an idiot I am. <clears throat> How's the pack weight? Honestly, awful. I mean, it's, that shouldn't be a surprise to anybody, right? It's, uh, that's why I have the 18 plus, uh, above the FIFA points, because this is gambling your money. Gambling your money on a losing bet. I mean, that that is what it is. EA might want to deny that and pretend like this game is Peggy 3, but it's not. So, nah, packs are terrible. Packs are, uh, packs are awful. But at this point, I'm an adult. I'm well aware. We, we know we're just lighting money on fire. It's, it's just for a bit of fun, and it's to give us a nice start uh, on this ultimate road to glory. And it just allows me to test out players... To give those of you guys that are fans of the stream and the YouTube channel uh, player reviews and, and ideas on what players are good and bad. Pack weights weren't awful. Everyone would have Neymar dot dot dot. <laughs> Thank you for pointing out the obvious ghost breezy dot dot dot. Seeing a lot of those lately from you. Uh, refrain. I don't know what you got going on lately, but uh see. get better for you. Dot dot dot. Easiest way to see your consumables for me is on the web app so far. There's no, uh, hey there's no, there's no glitches Heimic at all. thoughts on my team and right any now. ideas on how I can and should change it of 30 KRN but open to big changes and selling main players BTW Suarez is so good he adds so much. Part of the negotiations of the pack process? Dude, are you out of your mind? Are you list, like, are you, is this your first time in the channel? You're arguing with me about all the things I talk about all the time. I'm well aware. I literally just finished saying that packs are a lottery. Absolutely. And you should be well aware that there is never a return on it. It's just to do it to, to get yourself uh, started. Hey, like, why are you digging yourself a bigger hole hey, than is necessary? Hope her enjoying FIFA so far. Seems a bit Girlfriend ridiculous. Girlfriend just left town after being with her one week. Long distance is so hard. Love is so strong for her and I get emotional every time we depart. Just need the Nick 28T chat and all to help me cheer up. I'm hurting. Much love. Does this cheer you up, bud? Let's go! There you go! I burn in your honor! Oh, he's got 81 pace. Damn. Um, much love, I burn. Much love, bro. Life ain't easy sometimes, man. Uh, you know, I can't at the flick of a flick of a command just make you happier, but I'll do my very best, brother. 
And uh, Karen Z, I'll have a look at your team in a little bit. So, I think that's where we're going to end things, boys. Thank you all so very much for yet another fun episode. I'm still in disbelief that we got ourselves Neymar. Let me know what you guys would do at the start of this ultimate road to glory. Do we stick to Neymar? Do we now have a challenge with Neymar to try and get a thousand goals? Or do we use Neymar as a springboard to getting the one player that we get every single year on this rich man experience, which is Ruud Hullet. The last three, four years, our first purchase every year is, uh, is Ruud Hullet. So, I don't know. I'm going to talk about it with my Twitch chat as well. Uh, Twitch.tv slash nick 28 By the time you're done watching this, I may or may not still be live. If you're watching this by midnight UK, I might still be live. But I'm going to be continuing to open packs and uh, and just chill out with my audience over on Twitch at nick 28 Thank you for everything. And we'll catch you on the flip side tomorrow for yet another epi starting at 6 p.m. UK. God bless. Peace.